Hey everybody, Secret Code here, and we got Snacko, an adorable little kitty that reminds me of my kitty, Akuto. Um, lift the curse and revitalize an island in Snacko. Uh, the um, former big city kitty Momo and Mikan, or Mikan. Oh man, sorry about that noise in the background, guys. They're doing construction here. Um, anyways, we're gonna get started because this game is adorable. It's a farming simulator, cozy type of game. And how are we not going to get started with this gorgeous game? Jump right in. I really hope I hit record. I'm just going to check real quick. Yeah, I did. Oh, I think I can see the line in the distance. Huh? Oops, sorry. Did I wake you up? How'd you sleep? Any dreams? Uh, not sure. It's hard to remember dreams after you wake up, huh? I remember the one I had. It was just me sleeping back at home. Hmm. It's not home anymore, huh? We don't have a home to go back to. It's too late to go back, isn't it? Hmm. Hey, no teasing. You're not homesick, even a little bit. <laughs> nope. Wow. I always knew you were the braver one. Huh? Don't give me that no-duh look. Rude. Well, we'll be fine. I know it. We'll be okay. I'm not okay. Uh, uh, oh, uh, it was just a, a thunder. Wait, thunder? It's okay. I'm still a, a okay. Keep calm. Calm is important. <laughs> Maybe I will know I'd be okay. Wait, wait. This way? Too much water? Is this boat leaking? Should I start with scooping it out? It's time to jump. You can swim? All right. You took swimming uh, for felines on 101. This is your last elective. Well, I didn't. But it's too late for regret now. I'll just have to wave my paws. All right, ready? When you are. Three, two, one. Sorry, guys. I love to read and do this type of stuff. Am I okay? I can hear water. It's really dark. Am I underwater? Or dream? Children of the land. Uh, a voice. You must return whence you came and leave this land in peace. Huh? Hello? Wake up! Don't make me have to ring you out. Huh? There you go. Glad you just took a little bit of a ruffle. Don't think there's any problem besides from your wet fur. McCann? What's that? Maybe I got some water in your ears. Nah, Nubu, pleased to meet ya. You're lucky I couldn't sleep, so I decided to clean out my shedder there. So what's your name? Well, Akuto is a girl, and Hiro is my boy cat. But it looks so much like a Kuto, which means villain in Japanese, that I'm going to name it a Kuto. Um. Spring, baby. All right, Kuto. One can do the introductions later for now. Is that your boat over there? Guess I don't have to speculate about what happened. Hope you didn't pay much for it. Where's me, Ken? Now there's more, one of ya. Well then, let's not get ourselves in the donut yet just yet. I'm just sure she's just like you, shaken but not stirred. Stirred? Don't you worry about it. Let's have a, a peek around this beach and see if any soaked up kits turned up. 
feeling a little distorted. Well, the L to move around, you can use. Okay, okay. I think we're fine. Very, very unique look for a game. I like it. I like it a lot. <gasps> there we go. I'm guessing that's the fur ball of the weekend. And if she's able to snore that loud, she's probably just fine. Did you put it on a couple of times? Wake up, dumb nut. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not feeling sleeping. I was listening to a lecture. Huh? I could do <sighs> Akuto, I'm glad to see you. Wait, is this an afterlife? Did you get sand in your brain? P probably. If I shake my hand, maybe some of it will come out? Like a salt shaker? No, no. Don't tease the snowball. Poor thing just washed up the shore. Name's Nabu. Just found your friend down in the beach here. I told you are sure lucky. This here island, the only land round this way past capital city. The island? Does that mean we made it? We made it to Snackle Island? Ah, no more rain. Extremely energetic. Her kit who almost drowned. Anyway, weather don't seem too happy still. Let's head back to my house for some dry towels and food. Oh, wow. Thank you so much, Mr. Nabu. You're the greatest, the bestest. If you don't drop the mister, you'll be sleeping out here tonight. All right, kid. Let's get out of here. The storm before we get our cracking jokes. He has been wrecked, shipwrecked up, works up an appetite home. Go on, have your fifth wall of snowball. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, Mr. Nobu. What did I say about calling me Mr.? Just to call you Nobu, I remember that, Mr. Can't tell you if you're trying to be funny or if you're just dumb. Lack of own brain cells aside, you two really came a long way out here for nothing. Just cause you saw an island on a deli. We bought some camping supplies. They're at the bottom of the ocean now, though. I don't know where uh, we weren't happy with our job. So, you know, we figured why not go on an adventure? Not sure if your kids are brave or just naive. Well, our plan was to return home if it was going to be terrible. But the storm, our boat, don't worry about it, snowball. Worst comes to worst, just take my boat and buy me another in the city. <laughs> You're right. Thank you, mister. I feel much better now. Hey, you all ain't scared of the O.D. Hmm. Never mind. I ain't nothing. To be done about that tonight. I tell you, I must be exhausted. All right, kids. Let's get some shut eye. I ain't got a bed, but there's a room on the floor. Don't look at me like that. It's better than outside. Would be awesome if they were sleeping in a cardboard box, not gonna lie. Alright, lazy bones, up and at him. Oh, what time is it? Sunrise. Uh, breakfast time? I'm awake. <laughs> Alright, you kids. Breakfast, then you two will lend me a paw. Think of it as payment for letting you sleep on the floor. <laughs> they look like my cats. I'm telling you guys. Snack you.
People love these games, especially when they're this cute. Her ball doesn't look like she can even swing a hoe. Well then, it'll be helping me plant some seeds for the start. To start with the basics. Nothing more than a beginner friendly than than some turnips. No one has touched this plot of land in a while, but it's just overgrown. Soil's still good. I got some old tools and supplies for you. The, this here is what you'll need to give this farming thing a try. Receive basic hoe, a basic watering can, and turnip seeds. The basics of farming are still simple. Till the soil, sow the seeds, and water them every day till they get good for picking. There's more to it than that, but I reckon that's enough to get going. Why don't you try planting some turnip seeds? I give you. And it works fine as long as it's on the farm tire. Okay. Alright, Sprout, give it a try. I feel like I've been programmed by all the farming games I play just to know what to do. Let's till. I wonder if it's, uh, it's actually better to use mouse and keyboard. Okay. Do I, uh, oh, I see. Ah, uh, okay. X is. Really, uh, interesting to do on the controller. That there looking pretty good for a shitty cat. You're a natural. Wow, Yokuto. I knew you were going to be great at this. Well, uh, that's all the planting that's got to be done today. Or what's this? I still need some wood and some stone for projects. What is getting mighty close to lunchtime? Lunchtime. Uh, right. So why don't you, uh, kids, go grab some of those for me while I got to stir the food. Go on, grab me ten soft wood and ten stone. There's some old tools. Should be enough for you to get what you need. There's lots of trees around here in these pots. Get them. And the ones with the green leaves. I received the basic axe and a basic pickaxe. Just watch where you're swinging that axe, all right? Don't worry, mister. I read all about axes in books. <sighs> okay. Okay. All right. Alrighty. This looks like it's full of trees. I'm allergic to gathering wood, so I will just be providing moral support. Exactly what I need. Oh, okay. There's a power meter to that. Some mining. That looks like a lot of work. Tiring, isn't it? Don't work yourself too hard. You gotta take breaks, you know. Here, I picked up these berries earlier. I built that give you some good energy, some pep in your step. Then I'm a meter charging your two. I want to go back to that one over there. Oh, dang. I'm joking. Well, I was really good at keeping you motivated, right? <sighs> now I'm hungry from all this hard work. 
I wonder what lunch is. I do kind of hope the NPCs actually do cut down trees, do gather, you know. I would love a, a game like this where they actually work and they provide a part of the economy. What are you looking at? What was that? What was that? I hope it's nothing scary. Anyways, let's go back for lunch. Curiosity killed the cat. All right, kids, slow down. We got plenty of food here. Wow, you're gonna make food this good using the things you find and grow on the island? I'm sure stuff. Thanks for the meal, miss. Glad you like your snowball. I'm surprised a kid can eat that fast. I've been curious. What's living in the city like? I've only been there to visit family and the marketplace. Um, well, there's a mix of personalities. Many are nice, but some can be very rude. They'll, they'll scam you. Uh, where did that come from? Well, you see, when we're buying supplies, a merchant called me over for a magical snackle. It was supposed to turn into a big meal and we did enough to feed 10 liters of water. And they didn't. Of course they didn't. You didn't see any floating hamburgers when you found us on the beach, did you? Uh, I suppose. And then there was the, the time. So I had to round the chickens back myself. And after that, we had to go through the door to door. That's terrible. It wasn't terrible for me, but how did you feel, Kuto? My soul exited the atmosphere. <laughs> yeah, you were like a walking ghost. It was just the same every single day. Got very tiring. We thought we should just try something fun before we end up doing the same thing forever. <laughs> you heard about that island, haven't you? You mean about the goddess cursing the island? Um, yeah, we were taught a bit of it in school. Well, I don't know if you know this, but you can't get to most places on this island anymore. My asthma, my asthma, all that. They say the remains of this town in the beach area you washed up on are the only safe spots left. Well, no way to go out and uh, use the island here you want lift. Either went back home or moved to the city. Why are you still here then? I'm a stubborn one. This land's been in my family for generations. All farmers. A lot of work to live here. So, you still up for it? Yes, sir. Yeah, we can do this. That's good enough for me. All right, follow me, kids. Time to wrap up today. I got a gift for you. Sprouts. Stop squawking and start moving, kids. Sooner we get there, the sooner you find out what it is. Well, you did a good job, Sprouts. I did make you do all that for nothing. The farm is all yours. Wait, really? Yup. Poor thing. I can't bet a row of chickens you'll be just fine. <laughs> wow, mister, you're too kind. Not to be um selfish, but... What about me? Don't worry. I got a place in for ya. I'll tell you about it later. It's just handling shipments. Oh wow. I get my own place too? Alright, Sprouts. You got the farm, but you also need a roof over your head. This here is a blueprint for a house. If you read carefully, you'll be able to make it with your own paws. Go ahead. Give it a look see. You can learn how to craft different things by reading blueprints. Hover over it in your inventory bar and use Y to commit it to memory. Once you've learned the recipe, you can make it at any crafting station by interacting with it using A. Just make sure you have all the materials. Nice, I just learned to build some new crafting stuff. See, it wasn't hard, was it? Just, uh, was it, uh, was it, Sprout? Now you need a place to make it. I received a small workbench from Nabu. And one more thing, to place that, you're gonna need to set up one of these. A 
builder kit. That's all I got. And the tools in there will help you set the planes up, you know. Equip that just like your other tools. Okay, builder kit has all the tools you need to equip and use it to enter build mode. Where you can place, move, and uh, die buildables. In build mode, the screen will have prompts to help you to help guide you on your decorating journey. Open the item up. Okay, okay. Anything that puts away in build mode that won't fit in your rut stack, include items with storage containers, will go into the crate. Ah, this is truly a paw on experience. Right. I don't know if you uh, want, I uh, went and given you uh, the rest of the materials for a starter house too. I go on, plop it down. Plop down the small workbench so you can go crafting. It's just not uh, any use of you when you're sitting here. All right. All right, all right, all right. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. We'll just put it here for now, I guess. There you go, you sprout. You're this much closer having your own house. Wow, this sounds easy so far. I thought owning a house required a lot more work. Go order your small workbench and get those paws moving. So, apparently I already have a lot of this stuff. Oh yeah, because he did give it to me. And then, uh, where's a good spot for the home? Construction makes good background noise. Perfect. Arr, arr, proud of you, Sprout. It's your own house. You made it that yourself. Well, let's go inside. I've got a present for you. Oh, more? Let's go, let's go. Oh, how you like it, Sprout? Can you believe you made it yourself? It's small. Once you settle down, adding more room should be a piece of cake for you. Don't worry about it. This looks nice. You're good at everything you do, Akuto. Alrighty. And this year is a gift I told you about. I got a set of furniture and a bed and a bookshelf, even on a floor lamp. I found some old furniture here in the shed. Hope you can get some good old use of it. You can use these for now, but you should check out the bulletin board in town tomorrow. It'll teach you how to make your own furniture, free stuff. Yeah, it's better when it's free, isn't the Sprout? Anyways, go ahead, place it down with your uh, builder's kit. Bulletin board, okay. And journal for quests. I got that, I got the basics. This is where RPGs always play the bed anyways. This is where they usually place the bookshelf. Put a lamp right here. Container right there, you know. Well done, Sprout. In a, in a top of the carrot, but it sure is a homie. Oh, a lamp. Let me <laughs> uh, let me show Snowball where she'll be staying. I'll be waiting for you outside, Snowball. Say your good nights and all. Okay, Mister. I'll be real quick. I see you tomorrow. You better be up. 
and crack a dawn in your heart. Wow, that was a lot of info to take. You're gonna be a real farmer. Wait, you already are a farmer. <laughs> How exciting. I can sell your stuff and you can make this stuff. What, uh, what do you mean that doesn't sound fair? Super fair. By the way, uh, what happened when we got split up on the beach? Were you okay? Oh, it's kind of scary hearing random voices. I'm not sure surprised. You might have had a nightmare like that. The storm was scary. When the boat started leaking, my brain started to leak too. Yeah, it was such a bad luck, huh? Well, now it'll be good from here on. The memory is so vivid. It feels like it just happened yesterday. Oh, wait, it did. Um, anyways, I'm just glad we're lucky to meet the mister. I'll work real hard to pay the uh, his kindness back. You gotta do that too, okay? I'm ready for a new life. Snacko better than me. Okay. I'm ready to get to work and play. Child, you must heed my word. This land can no longer support you. From you, who has caused my fall. The miasma has risen once more. Morning, Mr. Got me a place to stay, but it needs some um work. It needs some work. But yeah, uh can you come help me please? Building her place is kind of work is better when you're with others. You're saying that cause you got to take more breaks, huh? <laughs> so mister, you know how uh you let me borrow some books last night? Uh, yep. Uh there's a book in there about the local history and I was thinking if the miasma had something to do with people losing faith in the goddess I mean it kind of feels like everyone just stopped believing in her and the miasma got worse so do you know anything about that mister I don't want to talk about it oh why not you haven't told us anything yet that's a mighty touchy subject and uh around these parts when I was a kid as a friendship's broken up over arguments regarding all of this. Ooh. Me? I don't feel either way about it. Miss Missina, or that's the goddess name. By the end of everything, for everyone moved out, most folks believed in Messina. First this island as revenge. Revenge? Hey, yup. Nobody could agree with whether or not to continue the offering. Some folks said we needed to feed our families first. Others said without offering, the goddess wouldn't be able to do her duties. That's where it got hairy. Not many folks believe that the goddess needed to offer and says she's been selfish and petty. Anyways, I just don't want to talk about it. You'll get too many uh, good memories. Just keep away from my asthma, you hear? Oh, okay, that sounds complicated. Well, I'm sure we'll find out. Uh, yeah, without getting too close to my asthma, of course. Well, we're done out here. Let's do the interior now. Wow, this is such a cute yellow house, very yellow. That's the both of you. I've got a co cozy house now. I'm sure glad we live in it. Uh, I still don't get why or anyone would want to move here, especially with the reputation and all. Hmm. I think everyone I know our age doesn't mind that kind of stuff as much. Then he's just calling me old. Plus the air is nice. Life isn't hectic and sad. Why not just move to the outskirts of the city then? In this economy? Bring it on, my asthma. You can scare me more than the VP of operations. All right. So if you want to see more of this lovely, beautiful, gorgeous game, I will have a link below. Is that an early access right now? It's like the most cutest game ever. Look at this cat. He's so adorable. He's so adorable. And it's out now. Try it. Early access. Can't go wrong with these beautiful visuals. Don't forget to like, subscribe. But I'm only stopping now because the construction is getting heavy. I would play more of it. Um, dialogue heavy at first, but I'm sure the gameplay is going to be incredible. Oh, look, a little bit of this town here. Look at that. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I am Secret Code. I love you. Have a great week, weekend. Have a great December. I love you all. Secret Code is out.